Hey, what's going on guys? It's me, the King of Metal here. Just wanted to let y'all know I bought myself a new uh, snare drum from uh, Dave's Drum Shop here in the city of Ottawa. And what is really good about this snare, it was uh, pretty much a uh, budget on a good budget that I was looking for because uh, the snare that originally my guitarist uh, Trey Graham bought on uh, Kijiji was the same brand as uh, the other, as my brand new snare. So it's a Tama Woodworks 14 by eight inch snare. Best snare drum to get if you're on a uh, budget for a big snare and you can't afford one that is over past like probably over a thousand dollars or something. I couldn't find any good snare that was uh, in between to buy over $500 to $1,000. And uh, unfortunately, I couldn't do that. So I tried out Tama's Woodwork Snare. The one that I have here is a 14 by 8 inch. And uh, it is by far incredible. I already gave it a tune. And the sound as usual and of course you'll see a quick video on how I did a little uh, demonstration of it and uh, that's about all I can say so far so uh, just wanted to share this to you and see what you think and uh, that's all so enjoy part of the video folks
And that was all on the video. So uh, basically all I did was give it a good demo example and a little play of it, see how it felt as it is. I already switched out the heads when I bought it and uh, put on my current drum head and by far tune it up to a good sound. I tuned it at a medium pitch because uh, it was by far, yeah, either medium or high pitch, but I chose the medium pitch because I really love the sound. And low pitches are okay, but I'd rather tune it up a little extra more, and that's about it. Reason I wanted to go for a 14 by 8 inch snare, it was kind of a little inspiration from Vinnie Paul. I know when I checked out videos on YouTube with uh, some of it with uh, his drum setup, it was pretty cool. But when he had a 14 by 8 inch snare, and I knew right away, I was like, I actually like this. I think this is going to be what I want to go for a 14 by 8 inch snare. I just love big snares. Originally in the past, I've had a 14 by five and a half inch uh, Thomas snare drum, and uh, I don't have it yet, but I'll probably get it and add it into my snare cut snare drum collection as usual. So that's gonna be what it is. Um, I also also remember having a. Uh, Ludwig accent snare, one of the beginner drums, uh, f snare drums for a beginner's drum set. It was 14 by uh, six and a half, and uh, it had a great sound when I uh, tuned it up, so that's about it. So now I'm just ready to continue playing a big 14 by eight inch snare, and that's about it. If you are willing to want to get yourself a snare like this for yourself, I will leave a link down in the description to uh, show you where you can get it. And, of course, uh, that's all. So, I'm going to give this video a big special shout-out to Dave Dudley from Dave's Drum Shop here in Ottawa for always keeping, keeping me well taken care of on interesting drum gear and stuff. Besides, Dave's Drum Shop is... By far, my number one favorite place to shop only in Ottawa, Ontario, Canada. So anyway, I just wanted to uh, tell you all a little uh, about my getting uh, going from using a small snare to a big snare. So that's all. So that is all. I will see you in the next video. Probably I won't. Upload something up for uh, Halloween, but I will be, I will continue to sh uh, post some stuff on TikTok in case you miss out. Anyway, that is all. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out to all of you. Keep rocking it out there and hasta la vista, baby.